Uh, good evening, everyone. My name is Maria Sikańska, and I'm 17 years old. I'm a student in Strumenia High School in third grade. My favorite subject is maths, uh, and I also really like Polish and English, and I'm taking those subjects on advanced level. Uh, I also really like Spanish, and um, I have uh, over nine months break on Duolingo. Mm, yes, I'm persistent and ambitious. And those uh, qualities I gained through chess, which uh, is my biggest passion. I play it since I was 10 years old, and I have some big achievements, such as 13 medals on Polish Juniors Chess Championship. I was a runner-up at Rapid World Chess Championship in 2022, and I won a bronze med medal at European Chess Championship in 2023. Also, I qualified to Polish Women's Chess Championship, where only 10 women from whole country are allowed to play. But my biggest achievement is that I can work hard every day, that I work systematically and I do my best to pursue my dreams. Also, chess taught me other useful skills, such as dealing with stress, dealing with my emotions or working under time pressure and the most important thing i learned from playing chess is how to lose because like defeat is something we cannot uh, we can't avoid but it's something very useful if we know how to draw conclusions from it and how to become a stronger player afterwards so how did i started playing chess well my parents are chess players and they met on the chess tournament so it was obvious that <laughs> I would also play it and my daughter my, my father was uh, my first coach and he taught me how to be a hard worker how to work systematically and he also taught me uh, some deep understanding of chess positions uh, also, thanks to chess, I have great contact with my older sister, Zuzia. Uh, she's also a chess player, and we often go to the tournaments together. So right now we are best friends. Uh, and yes, my whole family gives me very big support. And no matter of the result and very big encouragement to pursue my dreams. But uh, besides the personal growth, chess also has opened my eyes to fascinating world of artificial intelligence because uh, right now there there is a very powerful tool which is alpha zero the stockfish based on ai and also some other uh, chess engines such as uh, stockfishes uh, also based on ai and i think it's amazing that right now everyone has access to such a to to like st to Stockfish uh, 16, which is um, based on AI. And like, it's the best uh, player in history. And right now everyone uh, can learn from it within seconds. And also it's very important that it's completely free. And so right now everyone has unlimited um, training possibilities. And I think that's very important that the knowledge which used to be privileged Right now is very common. So I, after I realized that, I understand uh, who I want to be in the future. And I also want to share my knowledge and I want to work with AI uh, because I think that sharing knowledge could be very helpful to uh, helping other people's circumstances of their lives um, because they would be better educated. So that's why I think that this scholarship could help me because uh, there I would see uh, people who really work with AI and to see if it's something if if it's the place for me. So to sum up everything, I'm a chess player, and for this I gained some useful skills such as being a hard worker. But playing chess is not something I want to uh, do in my future because I want to help others. And to do this, I would want, I would like to be, uh, like I don't know, AI designer, a developer, sorry, developer, 
And that's why that's one of the reasons I would love to go to the Silicon Valley. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Marisha. And uh, Marina, may I ask you for the first question? Who will you consider as a father of AI? Uh oh, I forgot the name. Uh like I read a book would about be, would be American or British. Oh, I'm sorry. I like I forgot the name. I read two books about like artificial intelligence in chess. Uh, the question like... has that answer in it. I mean the the the, the most recent question by Magena. Yeah, American or British. Okay, the question was not easy because uh, it is difficult to name one person as a, fa as a father of AI. I mean, obviously, uh, the work on, a, on, an AI, uh, on AI, uh, AI uh, began uh, uh, in the second or third decade of the last century. Uh, John McCarthy or Turning are the, the names. Turning, I, I was, uh, I was uh, thinking about. And I don't know whom you were thinking about, uh, who was named as the father of AI in the books you've read. So it would be interesting to learn. <laughs> uh, like, sorry, I, I don't remember just like I read it uh but i just i don't have the best memory to like to names so but i think it's worth knowing if you are uh, interested in ai uh, uh the story of the beginning of you know of this uh, uh part of uh scientific scientific work thank you thank you very much Piotr. From my side, the, the question about your social activity and uh, what are you doing uh, out of chess? It means, um, of course, you are um, learning school, but uh, what are you doing for society? Uh, I had uh, I had a lesson in my school with, in which I taught students uh, about about chess, but not only. Like I taught them basic rules of chess, but also uh, how to pursue their dreams. And I was uh, invited to like uh, to other school, where also I uh, have uh, I had a lesson about about like how to um, set your aims, how to achieve it. Um, so yeah, that's the two main things connected to chess and to like social activity. It means um, you, you you give the lecture of motivation. Yeah? Yes, yes, basically, yes. Okay, thank you. Marisa, do you know who you want to wanna be in the future? Uh, I want to work in, like, in a company and I want to work with AI to help others. So, um... That's okay, but uh, what kind of company? And what AI? Because you know, uh, now we are saying we are working with uh, AI, but in the future, everyone is going to work with the, with AI. Uh, when you are 25, 30, AI is everywhere. It's like saying now that I want to work with internet, right? I mean, 30 years ago, that would be something, you know, very interesting, but now, so who you wanna be in the future? Uh, someone who develops uh, the uh, like who <laughs> I'm sorry <laughs> I'm sorry I'm a little bit sick so uh, yeah I want to be someone who develops AI so uh, like I'm not uh, I don't know how to say it so I don't want to be someone who works with AI like use AI as a tool I want to be someone who really have impact on how the AI works to because I think that's the way that I can change the world the like 10 years uh, after 10 years, yes. Okay, and how you think 
uh, the Queen Hedding Scholarship will help you developing your skills. Like, who would you like to meet in the Silicon Valley? What kind of questions uh, you would ask uh, this person? Uh, and how, how your community will benefit out of your trip to the Silicon Valley? So I would uh, like to ask um, some um, like some students on Stanford University. Uh, I want to ask them why they uh, like how they chose their path or career of careers. Uh, so I would make sure that <laughs> I'm doing the right thing. Also, I would like to ask questions uh, to like to to the heads of those big companies. Like well. I'm not going to meet them, but if I uh, if I would, I would ask them like how they think uh, like mm, I don't know how to say it. So I would ask them how what they've done to be who they are. So how they became so successful, mm, and how my community would uh, benefit from it. Well, I think that in my school we have a very Mm, like very good opportunity that if we learn something, we can make a presentation and invite whole uh, high school and give the presentation to educate others. So I think that if I learn something very interesting and if I go to Silicon Valley, I know that I would, then I would uh, organize this meeting and share my knowledge with others because I think that's the that's very important nowadays that we don't share, <laughs> like we don't keep the knowledge to uh to ourselves we share it so the so other people can benefit from it okay thank you very much for your answers uh, Marzena, may i ask you for the feedback sir i like the way you present uh yourself and the subjects you are uh, passionate uh, with so this is something which uh, really I think uh, is uh, is something to to be highlighted, uh, the way of communication. Well done, thank you. Thank you very much, Maria. You are a great person. You have uh, very uh, high skills uh, in chess. I think that the skills will help you to develop your uh, your skills in the other um, subjects because you need to find something special for you. In my opinion, you are very focused on on, on chess, but chess are um, uh, could be very helpful in a lot of areas. But you need to find the subject you are very interested in. I haven't seen it from from your presentation, but. Really, your presentation skills are high, and uh, uh, your knowledge about the su different subjects are, are, are visible. Uh, and thank you very much for your presentation. It was really good. Thank you very much. Thank you. Marisha, uh, it was a great presentation. Thank you very much. Uh, you are an extremely talented person. Uh, I, I share the opinion of uh, Piotr Kaminski that uh, you escape in, into chess too much. Uh, so uh, chess were covering too much your personality. Um, uh, and uh, as I understand, uh, chess is, is just an instrument for you to achieve something. Uh, to yeah, do yes, that's true. That. But you won't, don't want to be a professional chess player, right? Or you do? No, no, I don't want to. So too much about chess, by the way. Who is the best chess player in your house? Because I have the impression that everyone's playing. <laughs> <laughs> well, I play two of my sister plays and my parents. And well, I think that right now I am better than my parents. So I would probably be the best in my house. And you are modest. That's good. <laughs> uh, Marisha, thank you very much for your presentation. Uh, you will know results in about uh, two months. Uh, if you have any question uh, in between, please let us know. Uh, I wish you a very nice evening. Thank you very much. It was a pleasure to meet you. Thank you. Wish you all the best. Thank Bye. you. Thank you. 
and remember about the, the public voting. Because yeah, yes, 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 I, I remember. Important. Very important one. Yes. Thank you. See you. Bye. Bye. Bye.